After around 150 injections, it is necessary to exchange the septum, as it can begin to leak. Each injection also begins to contaminate the liner, forming active sites. After the injector and the oven have cooled to below 50 degrees centigrade, maintenance can be started. To access the septum, loosen the retaining screw and remove the septum. Due to their special shape, Shimatsu's uniquely designed T-Scepter create a reliable seal. The septum is placed on the injector head and fixed with the septum screw. A needle guide ensures the syringe can pierce cleanly through the septum. The retaining screw is hand tightened and then loosened by a quarter turn to allow the needle to slide through with ease. A syringe can then be used to test the septum is installed correctly. The needle should slide through the septum without resistance. The liner must also be changed regularly. The frequency of this depends on the sample matrix, however a general guideline is to replace the liner every 200 injections. To change the liner, release the latch on the injector. If the o-ring inside the injector is stuck, loosen it with tweezers from the side. Avoid pulling on the liner to prevent it from breaking. Once the o-ring is loosened, the liner can easily be removed. Ensure that the new liner is installed in the correct orientation. Slide the o-ring onto the liner and position it near the top. Now rest the liner in the injector and gently press down until it's in place. Reattach the cover and fasten the latch to secure. To check the system is leak tight, activate the gas flow and check if the injector pressure remains stable. Alternatively, you can start the automatic leak check utility. After the maintenance is complete, the counter for the septum and the liner can be reset. Excellence in science. Shimazu.